salvation. No. You can have money. No. You can have fame. But it doesn't can't compare to the salvation of Jesus Christ. Because you can't take that money with you. You can't take that fame with you. Anywhere. You can't take none of it with you. What's that saying? I never seen a U haul back of a hearse. Oh, come on. That's a true statement right there. Come on. That's a true statement. Woo, God bless you. Come on, God bless you, Pastor come on. Dale. Yeah. For your vision. Yeah. Your vision lines up with the word of God. Yeah. Right. I love what you did, Pastor Sal. I mean, the Pastor Dale, you too, Pastor Sal. But right now, Pastor Dale. <laughs> Pastor Dale, I love what you're doing. I love the vision that God's given you. We're having church here this morning. That's right. We're edifying the body of Christ. Yeah. We're edifying the brothers and sisters. Come on. We're strengthening ourselves. Yeah. We're hearing the word of God to fill us up. That's right. So our spirits will be filled with God's spirit yeah. for the very purpose of not just for ourselves, but for the very purpose of tonight. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Let me Come tell on. you about tonight. God talked about it. It's in his heart. It's in Christ's heart to go out and make disciples. That's right. Yeah. In Matthew 28, 16, 20, let me read it real quick. Then the eleven disciples went to Galilee to the mountain where Jesus had told them to go. When they saw him, they worshipped him, but some doubted. Then Jesus came to him and said, All authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey everything I've commanded you. And surely I will be with you always to the very end. Of the ages. Yeah. Tonight, Jesus has given us the authority. Yeah. The authority to go out there and make disciples. And it's not just Pastor Dale's job. He's one of us. But it takes all of us. Yeah. To do the great commission of Jesus Christ. Yeah. And if we do all our parts, every each one of us here today. There's about 75 to 100 of us here. If I'm counting right. If we do all, with all our heart, with all our mind, and with all our soul, all those people that come, that are sinners, that are lost, that are backsliders, will get saved tonight because Jesus has given us the authority. The authority to make disciples. And tonight is that very purpose, that very harvest. Yeah, yeah. That's right. Preach. Some had doubt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There was those that worshipped, but some had doubt. Mm -hmm. My brothers and sisters, let's not have doubt. Right. Let's be worshippers. Yeah. Let's worship the spirit and the truth. Let's show our love. Let's remember how we were. Let's start again. We didn't want people to judge us. We just wanted people to love us. Yeah. So let's go out there and love. Let's go out there and embrace. Not the sin, but the sin. Yeah. With God's love that He made unto us. Good. Good. Amen. Holy Ghost DJ, one more turn me loose. Yeah. Woo! Are we having a good time with the Lord? Are you having a good time with the Lord? You need a captain.
Let's be going out and prepare for the tremendous fight. We have victory. Your word says you're on our side. And if you're for us, you're not going to be against us, not even the devil. So let's go out there with love, with power, with victory, with your mercy and your grace tonight. As all sinners go, let them be saved tonight. I have the privilege and honor to introduce a very good friend and brother that I've known for so long. We have done wonderful things together, but it's just the beginning. I know God has much more in store for us. Let's give a warm welcome, warm love to Pastor South Perez. <laughs> 